Well, the mayor's office saying today, yes, this is one of the most emotionally charged and sensitive issues. But I also talked to the co-founder of Black Lives Matters here in Los Angeles, and she says this is not isolated. It is part of a bigger problem. From City Hall to the streets of L.A., a Black Lives Matter conflict because of leaked emails. Vice.com now reporting that Anna Guerrero, Mayor Eric Garcetti's former chief of staff, made disparaging comments about Black Lives Matter L.A. dating back to 2016. We know that this has been an ongoing pattern inside the Garcetti administration. Um, he's attempted to dodge accountability. Melina Abdullah, co-founder of BLM LA, reacting to a report that says Guerrero said in an email, quote, I'm getting annoyed by all the lefties, not as annoying as BLM, but getting close. Mayor Eric Garcetti's office responded saying there have been difficult and painful moments of disagreement about race, but the mayor and his staff have always approached the conversation about racial justice thoughtfully with a goal of bringing people together. It's only the people who are in it for the people. It has to be by us. Abdullah insists the email is indicative of a larger problem within the Garcetti administration and that Guerrero should be removed from her current position as strategic advisor. Anna Guerrero should never get another public dollar. Anna Guerrero should also be exposed and she should really be seen as kind of the bully um, that she continues to show herself to be. For now, Guerrero is still serving as strategic advisor to the mayor's office. And the mayor's office says if there are comments that shouldn't have been made by current staff, quote, we will address those internally. Vice.com also reporting that last June, Guerrero was placed on administrative leave, but she has since rejoined the mayor's staff, still making well over $200,000 a year. We're live in downtown L.A. today. I'm Sandra Mitchell, KTLA.com. Glenn and Lou, back to you. All right.